Apple has released iOS 17.7 .7 alongside the brand new iOS 18. Most of the content you may see online is discussing the new iOS 18, which means iOS 17.7 .7 is forgotten about. So this is a bug fix update. This means you're not going to get features from iOS 18 in the iOS 17. So you're not going to get Apple intelligence. You know, you're not going to get the new home screen customization. Every feature you have in iOS 17, you know, 0 0.0, 17.6 and older, they're all going to be in iOS 17.7. .7. Instead, this is a bug fix update. And so if I go to the Apple support website and we scroll down, you can see iOS 17.7 .7 has released to fix flaws and vulnerabilities in the operating system. You can see all of these, you know, hacks that people were able to do. They're all here and they've all been patched with the iOS 17.7. .7. So what this means for you, if you update to iOS 17.7, .7, you're going to get the same experience as iOS 17.6.1, 17.6. However, the iPhone you're using will be more secure. However, if you update to iOS 18, you're going to get the iOS 18 feature suite. This includes the new home screen customization. This includes being able to lock apps, being able to hide apps. You know, you get the new passwords app. Every feature which you have heard about is, you know, fully running in iOS 18.0, excluding the Apple intelligence, which is coming with the iOS 18.1. There's also some AI features still missing in iOS 18. So the question you may be asking yourself is should you be upgrading to iOS 18 or staying on iOS 17.7? .7? Now, what I can tell you personally, my personal iPhone 15 Pro Max, I updated to iOS 15.1. I regret updating. This is just because iOS 18 at the moment has too many bugs. I even updated this software on my iPad and my iPad just wouldn't turn on half the time. I'd have to like forcefully restart the iPad. So, you know, I can't, really recommend updating to iOS 18 just yet. Just remember, if you update to iOS 17.7, .7, you will always have the option to upgrade to iOS 18 in a later date. Personally, as iOS 18 doesn't feel finished yet, many of the Apple intelligence features don't even exist yet. There's just many features that are missing. I'd recommend waiting until iOS 18.1 or iOS 18.2 before I'm going to upgrade to iOS 18 as iOS 17.7 .7 is extremely stable, you know when you update to 17.7, .7, you're going to be very happy. And if for some reason you're not, you can always upgrade to iOS 18. So hopefully this video helps.